Now there's guys like me that have to hunt for three straight months in order to get one shot at a big whitetail buck. But then there's killers like Cody Smith, who head out after school just once in a while, then slock a big one. Like old Popeye. At some point in his life, old Popeye's been gored in the right eye. But he's managed to grow old and get big. It's mid-October and a stiff wind is blowing in from the north. Cody and Popeye are about to meet. The day I shot Popeye was a school day. Uncle Ty picked me up from school. We got in the woods early, and uh, it was a real windy day. Just got in the stand, and a couple of does came by. We passed them up. I looked over my left shoulder and a giant was scraping a tree. Big buck, big buck. Shooter. Walking down this trail, he's committed, and I got a little rushed. Ty, Uncle Ty let me wait. Okay. okay. About 35 yards, I put the shot on him, and uh, I smoked him. I don't know who's freaking out more me or Uncle Ty, but it was the best buck of my life. I'm always going to remember it. It's October 20th. It's pre rut. The deer are moving hard. We had this nice buck come up. And just looked perfect, man. 30 yard shot, smoked him. Then about 30 yards, dead. Smoked him. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Massive ten pointer. Jeez. I'm just pleased to death. It's October 20th here in Fulton County, Illinois. He ruts. What? He has no eye. Is that Popeye? That's Popeye. We got trail camera pictures of this deer. We had several encounters last year. And uh, we got two years of him, a little history of him, and uh, nice sheds. He only has one eye from fighting. We let him go last year because he only had half a rack. He got hit by a car, and he survived. This is a nice deer. Now that I'm hunting with relentless pursuit, looking forward to next season with my new Matthews. <laughs>